congratulations on your movie. Thank you so much. So, uh, for the benefit of those uh, who do not have any idea what this movie is all about, could you describe your role okay. in this movie? Um, well, for Kaawa Sa Sulod, I play two characters. One is Lai, and the other one is Lieutenant Riza Omani. And they are two women who have very different beliefs, pero they're both very passionate of their love for their country. So, yun, um, the conflict, the main conflict is magkamukha silang dalawa. So, yung isa na pagkamalan, di lang yung isa. So, yun may conflict. Tapos, um, basically, it's a story of war. And magkamukha sila kasi in the face of war, iisa lang naman talaga ang mukha ng dingo. So, one thinks the other is wrong. The same goes for the other. Yung isa, akala niya tama siya, pero hindi pala. So, ano yung preparation mo sa physical demands ng role mo? Dahil talaga mo, para ka ng action chick. <laughs> Parang action chick flick, ha? Yes. Itong movie um, na to with social relevance. Yes. Um, it's actually something na I haven't done ever. Uh, I have never done uh, an action film. Pero, this one, uh, ang preparation ko was, uh, I boxed for four weeks, like a month before the actual shoot, I boxed. So, sobrang bata ko at that time, but it's not just, you know, superficial muscles. Pero, I really felt I was stronger also at that time. So, yun, I was working out every other day. And serious workout talaga yung mga one to two hours ako sa gym. And that's not something na ano, I normally do. Kasi hindi ako ma-workout. <laughs> Pero this one, I really prepared for it. And then more importantly, yung mindset. Kasi uh, bilang sundalo yung isang character, uh, yung, I had to act out also na sundalo. Yung isa naman, um, rebelde. So, marunong siya makipaglaban, pero hindi ganun kagaling as sa sandal. So, yung pag-differentiate ng roles, yun yung isa sa pinakamalaking challenges na ano, naranasan ko for this. Okay, lastly, uh, Dion, how was Direct RB as a director in this movie? Uh, Direct RB was just wonderful. So, and I mean it in the most honest um, part, the, the most honest me can say that. Uh, but also, um, because I'm co-producer of this film, nagbabot heads kami. <laughs> Nagaaway kami minsan. Pero it's all in the spirit of um, the creative part of it. So, nagbabot heads kami, but at the end of the day, we don't go to we don't end the shoot na may samaan kami ng room. So, it was good that he gave me the freedom to attack the roles how I wanted. And also, um, he was so great at guiding me with his vision. So, sobrang, sobrang na-appreciate ko. And I would not, I, I cannot imagine this film to be directed by someone else. Ah, sorry, meron pang isang pahabol na yes. question, Dion. So, what would life be like after Q Cinema? I mean, uh, how do you foresee the prospects of you attending international film festivals? Na talaga namang international film fest worthy yes. itong pelikula nung ito. Um, I know, we're actually in talks of, uh, me and Derek uh, RB are in talks and he suggested that we submit the film to international film festivals. And I'm so open to it. I think uh, the message of the movie is very inspiring because it doesn't matter kung which side you're on. But what's important is your love for your country and nationalism. So I think it's a very important message. 
Okay, that's all the time we've got. <laughs> and the memory or the <laughs> capa <laughs> memory capacity of, of this mobile of cell phone of mine. Super congratulations once again on your beautiful, awesomely done movie. Thank you.